you can create new access tables in either datasheet view or design view. The steps to create the new tables are similar to the steps you used before to add fields to an existing table and to define primary keys. Click create on the ribbon to begin. Click the table design button to create a new table in design view. Enter the information for the fields in the course table as indicated in table 6-1A on pages AC342. Ensure to select course number as the primary key. Check the data types for each field. Save the table using the name course and close the table. Make sure the Create tab is displayed and then click the Table Design button to create a second table in Design View. Enter the information for the fields in the Course Offerings table as indicated in Table 6-2A on page AC343. To set the primary keys, click the Row Selector for the Client Number field, hold down the Shift key on the keyboard, and then click the Row Selector for the Course Number so both fields are selected. Click the primary key button to select the combination of the two fields as the primary key. Check the data type for each field. Save the table using the name Course Offerings and close the table. Now let's import the data. Click the External Data tab and then click the Text File button to display the Get External Data Text File dialog box. Click the Browse button and select the location of the file to be imported. Select the Append a Copy of Records to the Table option button. Select the Course Table from the drop down list and then click the OK button. Click the Next button. With the Tab Option button selected, click the First Row Contains Field Names checkbox. Click the Next button and then click the Finish button. Click the Close button to close the Get External Data text box dialog box without saving the import steps. Use the previous technique to import the course offerings.csv file into the course offerings table.